Still charging up the cells, but um, today I'm playing a bit more with the alarm output on the cell log uh, device to see how well that works. Um, so this battery has been, this cell has been charged up um, and I've separated power supplies. So the left hand one's providing uh, a supply for the um, alarm system. So the cell log comes with this connector for its open collector transistor output. And I've wired um, the positive from this secondary power supply uh, to a LED. And then connected that to the positive input on the alarm. And then the negative output from the alarm just goes to the power supply negative. Um, it's set for normally closed operation, the alarm, so when it's at the moment uh, I've got the low volt, uh, no, the uh, over volt um, alarm on the pack set to 3.65 volts um, and if it's below that, which it is, it's 3.62 at the moment, um, the uh, LED comes on which would be the inverter um, inhibit signal so this would uh, I don't know um, probably set a relay um, and it would enable the remote signal on the inverter so the load would turn on so we'll turn on the uh, charger now uh, which will put 5 amps in and it will try and push the but the cell over 3.65, 3.6442, and we'll just wait. It should very quickly hit 3.65, um, and then you'll hear beeping from the device, and the LED should turn off. Okay, so now it's saying over, um, so it's triggered the alarm. Uh, and the LED has gone off, um, which would shut down the inverter. But you can see there's something going on here uh, because it's actually flashing on and off. It hasn't latched, um, which would be a problem. Um, this is showing continuously uh, 3.66 now and over. So the alarm mode should be set. Um, but what we're seeing is uh, some transition effect. Um, the alarm output certainly doesn't latch, um, which would have been useful. So I'll have to implement some kind of um, external latching of the alarm. So once triggered, um, it stays triggered and the uh, inverter will stay off. Um, otherwise the load will cycle and then all kinds of bad things will happen. So, I mean, it's 3.69 now, so it's not just a um, near the uh, threshold thing. Um, in fact, the lights come back on. Hmm. I'll have to. Uh, there's a forum for talking to uh, the manufacturers, and uh, they've done quite a lot of bug fixes in the past on the firmware on this thing. Um, so, we'll have to. Uh, check out why this alarm output um, is behaving a bit erratically. Well that's it uh, for now.